it's bitch cloud blowing time. What damn? <laughs> What's going on, everybody? Thanks for tuning in to NC Vaping. As always, I like to tell every one of you, thank you for tuning in. I'm um, a long time. People that are hanging in there with my crazy ass and all the new ones coming on every day and all the ones that's been in there in the middle. I appreciate it very much from deep down in my heart. And um, just thank you for tuning in and sharing the love and everything you do because I'm doing what I do for you. And I appreciate you tuning in to watch me. Um, it is, it's cloud blowing time. Ooh, hot damn. How was that Ric Flair would do? Woo! Hot damn, Ric Flair blowing bitch clouds. <laughs> all right, all right. Well, we're not here for this one today. We're here to talk about the Stellar by Tobacco. All right, all right, all right. We're going to go down low. We're going to take a look at this thing and unbox it. We're going to throw some coals in it. We're going to throw a wick in it. And we're going to see what this hot little thing right here will do from East Sigony. Yeah, got this from East Sigony. So we're going to see what this thing will do. So uh, sit back, take a vape, and um, let's flip down to the low side, and we'll see what's going on with this thing and see what she does. Hang on. Woo! Hell yeah! <laughs> Hang on, y'all. All righty, all righty. We back. Y'all didn't fall out your chair on the way back down there, did you? Uh, hang on just a second. Let me get a vape here. Ooh, doggy doggy. There we go. Woo, I have returned. <laughs> oh, I got Rick Flair in the head today. Uh, Got to look at the, after the North Carolina natives, you know. Oh, good old Rick Flair. Crazy ass fool. All righty. We open it on up here. We got the little goodie bag. Uh, this little goodie bag, all this little goodie bag has is some wire and um, some wick. Let me see if I can work with this. Um, Oh, that's about the best it's going to get right there. But, yep, no O-rings, nothing in this one. Uh, just some wire and uh, some silica wick there. All righty. And this is the the one off of uh, on E-Siggity that doesn't come with the drip tip. Um, I do believe they did have two on there, one that you can get um, that comes with a drip tip. And I think uh, on that particular one, you can, I do believe uh, it's you can choose between a black uh, uh, brass one or the brushed finished one here. Um, but I just chose the one that was just by itself. Um, they had this thing at a pretty good price. I think it was like fifteen ninety nine is what they had them there for. Um, but this one here, like I said, it is from East Siggity. All right, and this one comes apart pretty, pretty easily. Not too bad. Uh, O-ring is tight enough to keep it good and secure, um, but it is a good O-ring to where it's not real sloppy neither, and you ain't got to, to fight like hell trying to get this thing apart. Um, this thing does have a brass contact here on the end. Um, you do have a brass contact here, but this is the gold-plated post. It does have gold-plated post. And let me see if I can get this focus in here a little bit better for you, where this thing looks a little bit cleaner. Let's see if we can get it up in here where you can see it real good. All right. You can, as you can see, this thing does have nice size little holes in it. Look at them things. It's got some nice size little holes there. Um, Everything works really well as far as the thread on the screws. Um, you've got an okay drip well there for your juice, your juice well. Um, it's a little shallow, but I've seen a lot worse. Um, you can get a little bit of juice in there. Um, it ain't too bad, it ain't too bad. Let's see if we can get it up a little bit closer and I'll work this. There you go, you can see that pretty good right there. There you go, you can see it. See, it's not too, you got a little bit. I've seen a lot better, but I've seen, I've seen some worse than it. But you got less in there than that. So, And these things are set up to where it, it, uh, you can work these real easy. Real nice, easy build deck there. And um, I've got those screws kind of up and down on those now. But if you look, the center post is just a little 
your positive center post there is just a hair higher than your two negative posts. Um, so that works out pretty good. Um, sit this back down. And then this is the, the famous Cyclops eye on both sides. Now this is set up for you to run uh, dual coils on. Um, your deck you can put a single coil on there if you want to but there's no way of shutting off the air uh, on one side. Um, you, you're going to have you know you're going to have an open slide on both sides you know, regardless unless you shut it all off and you just spin the top here to trying to sorry about that trying to hold this thing where you can see it there uh, there you go yeah so it's it's not so bad that it's hateful that you got to fight it um, but you do have to put a little bit of pressure on it to turn it but it's not so loose that uh uh, you can't, and this does come right on apart. You sit there and twist it, and it's all machined really nice. It really is. It's made pretty nice. It don't look too too cheap, you know. Looks like it's pretty well made, and it's got another decent O-ring here. Um, I have seen some that's kind of got a little bit of shabby looking O-rings on them um, that really need to be replaced as soon as you get them, and that's pretty bad, you know. Um, but this one looks pretty pretty good. Well, looks pretty good. You can see right in there. Yeah. I mean, that's even beautiful inside. Look at that. Just the way it's machined. And then there's inside your drip. Or no, I'm sorry. Duh, there's the top of your cap. It's not really concave. It's pretty, basically flat. But it's not too deep neither. So, uh... It hold that flavor in there for you. That back together. Yep. By the time that deck goes up in there, you've got a shallow area here, so that flavor is going to come on out of there. It's going to roll and shoo, right on up out of there. Um, so that is pretty good. All right, all right, all right. Let me uh, sit this over to the side. I've got a couple 26 gauge eight wrap coils built here. I usually don't do this because my hands bother me some. I have problems with my hands here sometimes. Let me fix this right here. Um, but we're going to put this down and I'll go ahead and see if I can't do this. I will go ahead and tell you the truth. Uh, this is my second attempt because I kind of screwed up a while ago and when I was trying to trim one of my wires I cut one of my coal wires. Yeah, I screwed it up. So I had to start over again. <laughs> so we're going to see if I can get it right this time and not screw it up. Come on, baby, get in the hole. Yeah, gotta have fun trying to stick it in the hole there. There we go. All right. Let me get my host here. Get in there. And get you on in here and hold you right, right there. Let's see if I can get you tightened up. I'm going to try to rush through this. Or not try to rush through it. I mean, you don't want to rush through anything. You want to do it right. I'm trying to do this as quick as I can. That's why, like I said, sometimes I, I don't do this a lot on camera. Um, but I am trying to do this some. To, um, but I do have issues with my hands. And I'm going to go ahead and clip this wire since I've got him done get him out of my way. Where the hell did you go? And let me put my post back in here real quick. I'm going to see if I can't. I'm going to bend your ass around over here and kind of help hold you in place so you don't go nowhere. Until I get the other one in there. And then maybe this time I won't cut your ass. Alright, let's see if we can this one on in there. Come on. Share the hole. Yeah. Like I said, they're pretty nice sized holes. Um, I'm not really having no problem getting that. Those, those two 26 gauge wires in that same hole. Um, not really having a... I mean, it went in there fairly easy. I just... Eyesight, trying to sight that shit in and get it in there. You know what I'm saying? 
Let's get you all up in there some more. Come on, baby. All right. Let's get you tightened up. All right. You're tight. You're tight. You. Yep. Let's get you get over that way. Let's get you in here. Get you leveled out where I want you. Right there. All right. Let's see if we can't get some wire snip this time. Get my damn. All right. There's another one. That one. And there's that one. Hey, I don't think I did it this time. Nope. And all right, let's see what we got here. All right, all right. Got me a point four here. All right. All right, all right. Let's get some cotton in this bad boy and uh, get ready to juice her up. I got me some of my, been using, I got a vanilla custard here and a banana split. And uh, I'm going to tell you what, this one here is really good. This damn turtle cheesecake. Um, dripping drops from uh, Good as Gold. Uh, turtle cheesecake It is pretty damn good, I'm going to tell you. Um, I have been enjoying these while I've been playing with my uh, Addies and, and working on the coals and play, working on building coals and stuff, trying to get a little bit better at it. Um, I've been using those. And I'm going to tell you what, pretty damn good. All right, got that one in there. I'm going to use the banana split in this one. I got the turtle cheesecake in my other one there that I was using. Uh, when we started this, so I'm gonna run the cheesecake, or no, no uh, banana split. Come on, baby. There, there we go. I think we gotta get it in there this time. There we go. Alright, twist and pull. There we go. Alright, alright, alright. Let's get some cotton clipped off here. Get it laid underneath. Tucked on in there. We're going to leave a little bit on there. we got a little bit of room in there. Let me pull that back through so I'm going to keep that on me a little bit there. There we go, there we go. Get that out of the way, get that out of the way. All right, let's get this side. Get here. All right. Damn cotton, trying to stick to my damn fingers. All right, all right. Let's see if we can't get this tucked down in here now. Get you tucked on underneath. Get in there. There you go. And now let's get you tucked in here. Get you tucked on underneath that coal. Packed in there. There we go. There we go. All right. Let's get you wrapped around up underneath there and tucked back in there. There you go. All right. We about got it. We about got it. I actually could have put a little more cotton in here. It's not too bad of a juice well. All right, all right, folks. Here we go. I'm going to uh, take this on off here. We're gonna flip back up to the top side, and uh, I'm gonna slap this bad boy on my stingray here, and um, we're gonna juice her up and see what she'll do. So hang on, we flip back up now. Woo! Hang on for the ride. All righty, all righty, all righty. We back up top now. 
I hope y'all held on for the ride as the Big Crane Express brought you back up to the top side. All right. Yeah, I got a little ahead of myself a while ago. So uh, uh, right here before I came back, on the, on the ride back up to the top side on the bait train, I pulled my cotton out of there and heated my coils up, made sure they were good to go and everything, and then put my cotton back in there. Yeah, I forgot to do that a while ago. I was getting ahead of myself. Yeah. Like I said, I was trying to hurry up and get through that, because like I said, I don't usually do that on the cameras, because um, I have a hard time with my hands sometimes uh, with the stuff I got going on with them. So, um, well, enough of that. All right, let me borrow one of my other little drip tips over here. Let me see what looks good on here. Uh, this is a brushed metal one. Let's see how that looks. What do y'all think? That look all right? That look all right? Yeah. That one? Yeah. Looks okay. It's brushed metal. Um, like this. Man, that damn thing juiced up. Let me see if I can dry that off a little bit. Maybe fit in there a little bit better. Yes, I got another one over here I could use that one just looks nicer drying off a little bit see that let me see nah that's too damn shiny that needs to go back on that one there the, that double cross we'll, we'll run with this one on here maybe it'll be alright uh, O-ring's just a little and it's been used a little bit. It's all slickened up. And, you know, just a little, little wonky in there. That other one fit in there real good. That the other ones just don't look too good. I don't think I got another one up there that would look good on here. No, we're gonna have to run with this one. All right, let's. Uh, like I said, this time uh, uh, I'm gonna use some of the banana split. Dripping drops from Good as Gold. I'll put a link down below for them too, along with each Siggity. So if you want to get you some dripping drops from Good as Gold, I mean, got a great price on them, and there's some pretty good damn, pretty good damn juices. Um, I'm liking the flavors on them. I'm not having no issues with it, um, and they got a pretty good price on them. Uh, and tastes pretty good damn, pretty damn good to me. These do anyway. All right, let's juice this bad boy up. Do, 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 and see what she's going to do. Get you getting juiced. Yeah. You stay inside there. Cool. So get in. There you go. So get in there. Drip something down in here. Cross in here. Get it in there. Good. Yeah. Let's see what she's going to say. Let's see what she's going to say. What do you think? What do you think? What do you think? Ooh. Look at that. Look at that. Hot oh, damn. She's on fire. She's ready to go. Let's go ahead and juice her up a little bit more there. Yeah. That dried that up some right there. It's going to be a damn juice sucker. That's what it's going to be. That damn bill there is going to be a damn juice sucker. All right. Let's, uh. Get these coils lined up. Put that air hole. Get that push down on there. I got that. I'm, I'm going to close that a little bit. About halfway. And see how that does. Instead of being wide the hell open at first. I don't want it to damn gag the hell out of me. Alright. Ooh. Listen to that. Yeah. Ooh, damn! Talk to me still here. Damn. Damn, that's a damn juicy ass damn nanner split right there. Look at that, look at that. That's halfway open. I ain't gonna just gag the hell out of me if I open the wide open. Ooh, bitch clouds for life. Ah, damn. Still air by Tobacco from East Sigity. Pretty damn little good atomizer right there. If I don't say so myself. 
You can see I got about halfway over there. Let's take another hit. Ooh, hell yeah. Damn, that tastes good. Juicy ass damn bananas. And that damn vanilla ice cream. And I can taste that damn cherry in there. Woo! Damn, the room's fogging up. <coughs> Somebody called a fire department. <laughs> Woo! Hey, Miss Vake. I'm blowing bitch clouds. Ooh, look, you see that damn train stack go across there? Ha <laughs> ha! Here you go. Be careful. That shit'll hurt you. Could not hit it too long. Ooh, baby bitch cloud. Hot <laughs> damn. All right, e Siggity. I'll put a link down there in the bottom so you can get you one of these still airs. Really good deal. You just have to supply your own drip tip unless you get the other one where you can choose then if you want a black one, uh, the brass one, or the copper one, or the brass one, or the uh, brushed one like this one here, and then it will come with the, the drip tips in them then. Uh, but that will cost you more. This one here was $15.99 on their site. Uh, when I looked at it a while ago, it was $15.99. The other one is uh, $24.99, I do believe. Um, so, But that gives you a choice on which one you want and then a drip tip. All right, y'all. Y'all have a good one. Let's have a vape. And until next time. Woo! Vape on.